Hello, good day my lovely viewers. So sweet to have you back again. Today we will be talking about nursing. The topic, nursing, a gold mine. Nursing is indeed, indeed, I would say, is a gold mine. It is a gold mine. The, um, the first video I made introducing my channel, we had a challenge. We want about a thousand nurses to become, persons to become nurses before the, the span of June 2022. Are we going to achieve that? Yes, we will achieve that. I must tell you that um, one of the uh, persons I have mentored who um, has also read and uh, watched my video and who has become friends with me is now channeling her thinking into becoming a nurse and guess what this flower beside me is a gift I received from her plus two bottles of wine and some bas fruit baskets can you beat that so nothing 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 come to think of it nothing is a gold mine why do we say nothing is a gold mine? I want to do this video to portray on that point so we can all see some things that you may not have looked at. Yes, we can all look at it together. You see, if you like caring for individuals and you feel happy about it, you feel passionate about it, nothing might be something you need to consider. Yes. And another thing is that some feel that nothing is a calling. Some other people look at it as a career pathway. Yes, nothing is a career pathway. Today, we are going to talk about 10 reasons why you should choose to be a nurse. All right, please stay tuned. Thank you. One of the reasons why you should be a nurse is that you can, as a nurse, you have you can have access to quality training, quality training from the university if you cho if you so choose. Yes, and this does not take too much of a time at all, at all. Within three to four years, you're on your way to becoming a nurse and a qualified one at that, able to practice wherever you wish to. Can you beat that? This is one number one reason. Nursing is a professional, professional course. Now let's move on to reason number two. Why nursing a gold mine? Listen to these. These are the reasons. I'm going to give you 10 reasons why nursing is a gold mine. Some people see nursing as a career path, something that they just want to do. Uh, because they want to help um, humans in it. They want to provide care for people and that really gives them that satisfaction. Oh my, that gives them that satisfaction. That is good and that is commendable. But then is that all there is to nothing? Is this just the giving the care, giving the affection to people, caring for them, giving medicines, going to work, bash, bash, bash. Is that all there is to nothing? I've got good news for you. No, nothing pays you. I'm just gonna silence this. Um, okay, this device. Nothing pays you. Yes, nothing pays you. In what ways? As a nurse, you have a career, and in that career, you can grow your way through that career. Yeah. Secondly, as a nurse, you are. You're going to have opportunities to competitive salaries. Yes, you beat the prizes. This is the this is the amount I want to take. Your employers will follow you. Why? Because nursing is a gold mine. How do you know a profession is good or a particular specialty is good? You look at the labor market. Is there a scarcity in that field? If the answer is yes, then it's worth looking into. Nurses all over the world are inadequate. And when I mean all over the world, I'm not missing words. Name the country. They are short staff. Their nurses are inadequate. Yeah. Why do you think we have the immigration nursing, trying to write exams, trying to come to the UK, go to Australia, go to Canada, go to America? It is because they don't, they need nurses. Yes, 
And even when you're traveling abroad as a nurse, wherever you are, you you can you can you can you can choose your employers according to the amount they are willing to part with. If this is not paying you well, you want to change. Can you beat that? Nursing is a gold mine. A nursing is not the kind of job where you just go, you sit on the decks, oh I'm bored, oh I'm tired, oh I'm getting sick. With nursing, you're exercising your way through all through your shifts, going back, bash, 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 going back, 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 giving the smile to the patient, making decisions. You know, it is interesting. It is interesting. One difficult thing about nursing and the decision to be a nurse is that fear to start. When you watch to the end of this video, you come to see that you can combat that fear and it is worth it. The mindset change is worth it. And I want you to know today that however, whatever profession you have at the moment, are you an engineer? Are you a fashion designer? Are you a doc? Are you a, I'm not saying a doctor, but some doctors have chosen to become nurses because it's easier to get employed when you're migrating to other countries. Yes. And um, I'm saying this with evidence. I've got a lot of friends that are doctors. And some of them were nurses. They went to school school again as a doctor. And when they had to migrate, as I speak to you, they're working as nurses and they're, they're loving it. Nursing is very straightforward when you're going to another country. Pop, 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 you write some exams. You're good to go. That's, that is, that is nursing. Now, let's talk about 10 reasons why nursing is something you should consider. Let's be practical this time. Okay, one, accessi access accessible quality training option. You can choose a school and that's it. To get the ambition is very easy. When you are in school, when you come, you come out with a BSc, with a graduate, you are not a, people in, in the past look at nurses like, oh, they are people that were not able to make it in school. So they just chose to do nursing. Like, no, nothing has gone beyond that. We have people who are directors in nursing. Yeah, we have people who are professors in nursing. We have people who have their doctorate in nursing. It depends on your goal. Well, I'm not preaching you to go read, 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 read. I'm just, I'm just here to talk about how you can be, you can just be comfortable. Because these days, times are hard. A lot of graduates are there without jobs. Can you beat that? After doing four years in school, some are even working and they're earning peanuts. Their salary can barely take care of their bills. As a nurse, like I said in my first video, you can take care of your bills conveniently. Problems will be there, but the problems can will not overwhelm you. You'll be on top of your game. And guess what? If you have a supportive partner, you are good to go. The both of you will put heads together and you are good to go. It will be joy, 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 all true, radiating all true. You go to work with a smile. Can you beat that? So we talk about the first reason you graduate with a BSc and you just, for those that already have diploma in nursing, they want to become um, BSc nurses, just take them about 16 months to hear about. Why for those that are fresh out, maybe three to four years and you are there, you're a nurse. You get my point? You're there, you're a nurse. Now let's talk about the second point. Reasons why you should be a nurse. The second point. Now we'll talk about the second reason why um, you should consider being a nurse, really. Um, the second reason is steady industry growth. You see, um, registered nurses are in high demand. They are in high demand. And you come to see that because of the shortage we are having right now, you see that there will be a, a, an increase in the fact that um, a lot of people want to access health care there is not enough people to cover the needs so when you are one of, when you become one of us you become a nurse you can you are easily able to feel that needs and you can do your little bit you can be sure there will be job and that is a plus for you Thinking about becoming a nurse when I graduate, will I begin to? Oh, please, my, can I send my CV? I'm looking for a job. No, there will be a job just waiting for you. Not only will there be a job, you can choose the specialty you want to be in. You can choose the area you love. You won't just be forced, just like an engineer. Now, you are, you are, you are a road engineer. You just make roads, you know. But in nursing, you can decide to diversify. You want to be a cardiac nurse, an ICU nurse, a theater nurse, 
uh, a wound viability nurse, a diabetic nurse, you can diversify a pediatric nurse. Hi, pediatric nurses. Yay. You can become what you want to be in the profession. And that is a plus. Now let's move on to the third reason. The third reason is active, exciting work. Nursing is the furthest thing from a desk job. You don't just sit down and then you are just um, walking through the computer. You're not walking around. Yes, we know we have different specialty, but as a nurse, you'll be on your feet. You'll be attending to patients. You'll be walking through a dedicated team, through the healthcare every day. You'll see the outcome of your job. It is a profession that is excitingly encouraging, maybe challenging sometimes, but the challenges brings joy and happiness. Is this worth it? The answer is a big yes. Let's move on to the fourth point. A job that makes a difference. In nursing, in nursing we dispense comfort, compassion, and caring without a prescription that's the part i like we don't take permission to be caring to be kind to someone to be polite and soft-spoken to someone we don't take permission for that so nothing in nothing we do that we do more than take care of wounds in nursing we we care about patients we improve the lives of patients we take care of disease as come as a nurse we have the chance to leave a positive mark on someone's life almost every day your patients will trust you they will respect what you say they will listen keenly to you because they know you are an authority yes all over the world people trust nurses and that is a plus for you in this world where trust is something that is hard to get you are a nurse you will be trusted i remember somebody was telling me here in the uk can you go oh, i just called the landlord and i told them the landlord i'm a nurse i'm standing shorty for her and the landlord was like that's okay <laughs> the answer was like that's okay and do you know that in the uk here they trust nurses so much that if a nurse should speed and exceed the speed limit, the nurse is not fined. Once they discover the nurse, the person is a nurse, the person is not fined because they know nurses will not overspeed without reason. If a nurse is overspeeding, maybe she's going heading somewhere to save a life. Nurses are same people, people with sound minds, people that don't like to violate rules. Can you repeat that? Would you like to join the team? Please think about it. We are looking for nurses. We want people to come join this noble profession. Noble profession. It really, really, really kicks off poverty line in many families. Yes. And even those that are from wealthy families, they enjoy it when they practice nursing because they are impacting lives. You give money to somebody. You give care to somebody. Compare both. The person we appreciate the care far more than the money. We're moving on to reason number. Reason number what? I think this should be reason number five. In it, reason number five. Professional development opportunities. Because no day as a nurse is ever the same, you'll likely learn something new on the job every day. Yes. There we go again. You're progressing, you're learning every day. Not only I've gone to school, I've learned it all. In nursing, you never learned it all. And that is why it is interesting. It is interesting, and as a nurse, you have um, you ha um, once you have your BSc, you can also advance if you want to, and you can become a nurse practitioner. Yeah, you can prescribe. Some nurses can too, can prescribe to an accent. Yeah, we call them the nurse practitioners. It's up to you. Yeah, you can become a nurse practitioner. You can become a nurse anesthetist. Forgive me for my pronunciation. You remember I told you my name is Olodomos Past. So I'm just trying. You know that I'm brilliant. <laughs> so how do you pronounce that word? The nurse anesthetist. That's it. That's it. <laughs> oh, this my laughter will not stop. It's always just continuous. Um, you just have to accept it. That's me. I love to just give that smile. You can be a nurse leader and you can be a nurse educator. Yes, you can choose to be a nurse educator. So you can pursue any of these um, advanced degrees in a university of your, of your choice. Now we move on to 
reason number four why you should consider being well, no reason number six why you should consider being a nurse you have variety of work environments as a as a bsc degree nurse holder um you hold the ticket to potential employment at a corporate clinic nursing care facilities or school system for the more adventurous types there is also emergency flight nursing cruise ship nursing travel nursing among other unique job opportunities can you see the horizon it's really really wide think about it my darling think about it you can be a nurse you can do it we move on to reason number four why you should be a nurse think about being a nurse interesting specialty nothing has got some interesting specialty Listen to this. From psychiatric floors to emergency rooms, nurses have many options when it comes to finding a specialty that interests them. Besides, if you don't find the right fit right away, don't sweat it. Don't go panicking. Oh, I don't even know where I fit in. Don't go panicking. With a nursing, nursing degree, you are qualified for just any specialty. Once you've got your BSc, you are qualified for any specialty you later choose to be in. So you can make a switch is something pa, 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 very simple. <laughs> so for example, if you find that caring for adult patients isn't for you, you can always change course and become a pediatric nurse. Did, did I tell you I'm a pediatric nurse? Yes, so I'm a pediatric nurse. So I'm a pediatric nurse. So for me, I'm, here, I'm here in UK. I'm working as an adult nurse because I think there is a lot of job opportunities. They just get a job, pa, pa, pa. <laughs> but I love my pediatric nursing and I, I'll try to do a video for our mothers. Yeah, mothers, I'll do a video for you. <laughs> now, num question, um, reason number eight. Reason number eight, flexible work schedule. So depending on where you work, nursing shifts, lanes can fluctuate based on your needs. So that uh, means you can take evening shifts if you are not a morning person or you can work longer shifts over fewer days so you can spend a larger chunk of time with your family. If that suits your personal not shut all better you see that so you can organize your days you can organize your off if you want to be a night night worker day worker you want to do three days and take four days off it's up to you you want to travel every week it's up to you or if you're a traditional work schedule if uh, a traditional work schedule appears more to you you can often find what you're you're looking for by working at a clinic or phys physician office where you work monday to friday saturday and sunday off Five o'clock in the evening, you are done, you go, you're home with your family. It's up to you. Nursing is interesting. Point number nine, why you should be a nurse. Competitive salary. There we go again. With the current nursing shortage, you can expect job security and great wages. The mean annual registered nurse salary. Um, let's take, um, for example, one of the countries. Let's use Indian, for example. The mean um, average annual salary was sixty thousand dollars in 2016, according to the BLS. Other more advanced degrees need even higher salaries, with most anesthetists earning an average of one hundred and forty-eight thousand six hundred and fifty dollars, and most practitioners earning an average of ninety-nine. $99,240 in 2016. This is in 2016. We are in 2021 now. So definitely it has gone. It has gone up. Nothing. I'm loving it. Reason number 10. Why you should be a nurse. Well respected work. Like I said earlier, as a nurse, you'll be trusted in you'll be in trusted company with a long held reputation of being compassionate healers. Nurses consistently rank highly in Gallup research polls for honesty and ethical standards among various fields. In 2016, nurses topped the list with 84% of the public raising their standards as high. Imagine 84% of the public raises nurses' standards as being top notch top notch come on i feel like dancing top notch give me some music <laughs> a position the profession has held for the past 15 years can you beat that these are just 10 reasons why you should be in us why not think about it whatever is worth doing is worth doing well the most odd is to start once you start before you know it, year one is gone, year two is gone, year three is gone. 
Oh, and then I want to say a shout out to my baby girl in Dubai. She came out with a first class. Yay, nursing. She is a graduate nurse. I'll be making a special video for her shortly to congratulate her. Nursing, nursing indeed is a gold mine. Think about it and I'm sure you won't regret it. And if you're planning to migrate to other countries, nothing can just be an answer to that request. I'll do a video talking about migration to the UK and the laws here. I hope that will help encourage you to think about being a nurse. Thank you and bye. Thanks for watching today. Bye. Subscribe and like. I forgot to say that. Subscribe and like to the channel. Bye.